This tutorial shows you how to receive text messages very easily to your web server. We use HTTP POST to very simply post the variables directly onto your web server. We pass sender, which is the mobile phone number of the handset of the person texting in. We pass content, which is the text message content. And we pass in number, which is the mobile phone number the person texted to, be it a short code or a long dedicated telephone number. When you receive these variables, because they're posted behind the scenes to your server, you just store and process them. You can do this by streaming out to a text file or by storing directly in your database. It really is all very simple. Once you receive the variables on your server, you can store and process them as you choose, perhaps querying your database and replying back to our API accordingly. And maybe you would even use the sender to identify customers in your database and respond with a bespoke message accordingly back through our outbound API. You could configure a unique forwarding URL for each inbox by going to Receive on Messenger. View Inboxes and for each inbox you simply press Settings. Select Forward Incoming Messages to a URL. In the URL box you simply put the URL of your server. Followed by the receiver script name. If you're using an alternate port to the standard port 80 or SSL port 443, simply enter in the box. If you're using SSL, simply tick the SSL box. And if you're using HTTP security, where you can enter a username and password, simply enter it in this box. And that's all that's required to receive SMS text messages onto your server. Don't forget, within Messenger you can click on Help at any time. Or, of course, you can always call our friendly support desk. Thank you from the UK's number one mobile messaging provider, Text Local. Mobile, have you clicked yet?